All right, guys, so I'm just making an update video that I can share on my social media, both uh, Lifestyles of the Locked and Loaded, which is my B channel. I encourage everyone to go over there and subscribe to me. Also on Facebook, where I'm Hank Strange, uh, Instagram, I'm Hank Strange, and on the other social media like Twitter, etc., I'm Hank Strange. So I just wanted to uh, bring you guys up to date. Really, what I think is going on here, guys, is there is a concentrated effort at this time I think it's organized to silence voices like mine I'll be honest with you if you want to know what's going on with YouTube I'm not the only person my YouTube channel has been deleted there's been lots of other YouTube channels deleted outside of the gun game um, even airsoft guys are under attack most of the big airsoft people are off the air right now um, most of the people that are talking back since Vegas what happened in Vegas and what happened in Parkland here in Florida recently those guys are off the YouTube airwaves at this time and there's other gun guys in the uh, on the gun side of this there's other guys that are getting strikes so I expect those guys to be off the air unless they can do something to reverse those strikes today um, today Monday is the first day that we could actually do something about this and that's uh, pushing back with YouTube emailing them if you go to the bottom of any YouTube video you'll see there's a feedback button that you can send feedback to them uh, we also have a phone number as well which I'm gonna um, bring pull that up right now uh, YouTube has its one six five zero two five three zero 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 just a bunch of zeros at the end so six five oh two five three zero 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 and um, that's you know they're on the west coast so they're open business hours on the west coast you guys can actually call I hear right now there's like a 15 minute wait time so you can call them and you know ask about the gun channels that they're going after and other YouTube channels including mine specifically Hank Strange which has been deleted and taken off air if you look at what's happening in the news right now here in Florida Governor Scott just they just decided that you're going to have to be 21 years old to purchase a firearm in the state of Florida unless you're law enforcement or you're active duty that means only the special people can do that so if you're a young person out there and you're under the age of 21 they just took away your rights to the second amendment you should definitely do something about that you should definitely push back here in Florida we're supporting something called the rally and tally that I'm hearing is going down on the 4th of March in um, Tallahassee here we're gonna be part of that we're definitely gonna be there and we're gonna make our voices heard um, nationally President Trump just came out and said that he is gonna ban bump stocks quote unquote if Congress doesn't do it he's gonna do it by what he's alluding to is as executive order my opinion on all of these things is that they are not gonna do anything they will not stop things like this from happening in the future and you can't punish people or take away people's second amendment rights in order to to deal with a situation that's happened to other people I think there's lots of things we can do here there's lots of missteps steps and mistakes that were made in not only this recent incident but if you go back in time even further back than what happened in Las Vegas and this is not us these aren't solutions these are things that they're just doing to make you think that they're doing something and I just want you to know that they're deliberately at the same time silencing voices that speak out against this obviously the media is a hundred percent liberal and on the side of taking away guns and gun rights from Americans we know that so where do folks like myself go to in order to make our voices heard? We go to the internet, we go to social media platforms. Those platforms are now attacking us and I don't think there's anything coincidental going on here. We, you know, we're coming under attack on many levels. They're, they've killed off people's Twitter channels. They're doing this thing on YouTube. I've heard of lots of channels on Facebook getting um, taken down as well this is what's happening and we don't have anyone to rely on we cannot rely on conservatives on republicans on our elected officials we cannot even rely on pro second amendment organizations right now and i just want you guys to be aware of that and i just want you guys to know and i'm going to read this we are fighting back we're doing everything we can on all fronts okay when you have even pro second amendment organizations and i'm speaking about the nra specifically that is not they're not doing anything they're not saying anything about what's about what's happening and I'm pretty sure they're doing that because they have something called NRA TV as long as they have a way of controlling their voice they're not worried about our voice when you have the president that that was elected by people like myself 
and you have folks like Governor Scott that I personally voted for who are supposed to be pro-gun guys coming out and just hands down creating anti-Second Amendment legislation that tells you that there's a concerted conspiracy going on in America. It's not a joke. It's happening right now. People are taking away your rights. They're taking away your right to defend yourself because they're saying to you that they should be the ones defending you. If you really believe that, I don't care where you come down on politics, there's no way that any thinking person out there can tell me that the only person who could defend them is the government, that they're not allowed to defend themselves. That's what tyrants say when they're about to take over. And that's what we're dealing with, okay? And I just want you guys to know that we're doing everything possible to push back. But I really don't think that any of this happening is, is a coincidence. What's happening right now is they're trying to make sure that we don't have a voice and we don't push back against this. These guys know what happened the last time around. If you remember years back during the fire Armageddon when uh, Obama was going to do this, what happened? Guys like myself came out and made a big stink about it and we got you guys organized and we got you to push back against this. So now they're well aware of that, incredibly well aware of that, and what they're doing is trying to make sure we cannot do that. So I, I think that you have to step up here and do something about this. Push back, not just with me, but with all the other people that this is happening to. All right, so once again, I'm going to remind you guys, follow me on social media. I'm pretty much Hank Strange everywhere. I do have the B channel on YouTube up and running. It's called Lifestyles of the Locked and Loaded. I'm also on Patreon. It's Patreon slash Hank Strange. And, uh, you know, I'm going to keep up the fight, guys. Peace.